There are 700 billionaires in the United States. The only ones you hear from are those who need the attention. Well, I don't need the attention. You hear from me. There's probably more than 700, especially with, you know, this inflationary monetary policy. Y'all are going to be billionaires one day, just like Zimbabwe. They keep printing money. Um, but, you know, you teach their own. I'm here because I love all of you. I have a relationship with you, the community. I miss you guys. You add so much to my life. I can't tell you how much fun it is to see people from all around. You know, I, I'm here in Ethiopia. This guy flew in from Slovenia, and he gave me a Kirin mask. <laughs> it's uh, one of the coolest things in the world. I actually took a picture of it. Uh, it's, I have no fucking clue how he got it into Ethiopia, and I think the health minister wanted to actually confiscate it for a little bit because they weren't sure what it was. But check this shit out. Look at that. It's like a whole suit. You actually wear them, and it's like a big thing in, in uh, Slovenia. And I and he gave me this little package of paperwork uh, about it, what they are. And it's just complete serendipity. It's waiting for me in the hotel lobby. It, it, and I meet people all around the world that do this. Uh, and that enriches my life. I didn't even know about this. And I collect masks. I, I like to believe I know a lot about different cultures. This one blindsided me. Uh, and now i got to read about it and become like an expert on this thing. And that's like Slovenia, a very small country. And so I meet someone. He shares his culture, his history, his country with me. This job gives me the ability to do that. These AMAs create that relationship. That's why we talk. And we learn from each other. It's so cool. By the way, that guy runs a telco in Sierra Leone, and you know they're providing internet to some of the poorest people in the world. Do you use duckweed in your aquaponics? Well, I'd be a quack if I did that. 